<laughs> I was actually having a chat to our guest here, so I didn't even listen to what you were saying. But listen, our next guest comes all the way from Hollywood. He's a veteran actor. He even said he doesn't mind me calling him that. But he's <laughs> even been dubbed the king of commercials, having appeared in over 30 TV shows played opposite the likes of Jennifer Aniston, uh, Dustin Hoffman, Josh Duhamel, and many, many others. And he's now living in Cape Town, and he's here to offer acting classes. Uh, David, it's a real honor to welcome you here. And Thank also, you. may I say... Happy birthday! Hey, thank you, Happy Kat. Happy birthday Appreciate to you. It. Thank Great you for you to much. celebrate the morning with us like this. I know, yeah, it's brilliant. But you were telling me that you came down to South Africa in 2014, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. How's your experience of the country been so far? You know, the thing about Western Cape, it has like all the best bits of California. So I'm from LA. <laughs> it's like, you know, California has like mountains and beaches and like Western Cape is stunning. Like all the wine farms and we call them vineyards. But, oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's like everything here is like, it reminds me of home. Like I get to be homesick, but I'm already home because I'm here. Yeah, so. I I get yeah, that. And great. other than all of that that you've just described now, what, what else brought you here to South Africa? Yeah, um, you know, I think it started, I was finishing up a wildlife documentary in Kenya called The Sea Turtles of Lamu, and I needed to do some post-production for color grading and sound mix and stuff like mm -hmm. that. So yeah, this is some of my work uh, when I was living in L.A. But yeah, so when I came down here to actually do some post-production work on, on this film, and sort of doors were, I was living in Nairobi, and doors were kind of closing in Kenya, and okay. they were opening here. Mm -hmm. And uh, I met some people on a, I did a trip to the Holy Land, and I met these two couples from South Africa, and, and they invited me to come down for a recce to sort of check it out. And yeah. then it was just like, once I was here, it was like, Doors were opening here, doors were closing there, and you go with the flow. Absolutely. You know? yeah. And now with somebody with, who has a, a career and a resume like yours in showbiz, everyone always wants to know, where did it all start? You know, it was interesting, Kat, because I kind of was a presenter. I oh, cool. I, it was weird. I paid my way through law school selling skateboard wheels, and that got me into announcing professional surfing, which got me into presenting. And then my I did word. a student film. Uh, I went back to like this junior college after I got my, my JD, and then I did a student film, and I sucked. I was terrible. And I went, okay, this is the hardest thing in the world is to be a believable actor. And so I'm going to pursue this with everything, even though like I'm the worst at it. And yeah. Uh, yeah, so then I started pursuing acting. I moved back to Hollywood. I studied acting for six years and I started working. So. And of course, I'm, I'm sure you must have had some very challenging roles, being asked to do some pretty crazy things. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me a bit more about that. Um, you know, I spent two weeks uh, on a soundstage at the, on the Sony lot with, with Dustin Hoffman, Gina Davis, and Andy Garcia. I don't know if it's at the end of this clip, but like I was... I'm, I was up like on a two-story soundstage and there's cables and there's like there's bags down below you and if you fall over like you know it was really kind of a big secure situation so that was that was really fun um, yeah spending two weeks of that I have a quick funny story I just did a Detail. I just did a commercial in Mozambique and it was one of these drone shots you know yes, what I mean yes, yes, and it was my first time working with a drone but like you get used to it but there was a Mozambique local guy who was playing the fisherman. It was for Virgin Holidays, and all the, it's a four-second shot of me walking down this sandbar, and there's a guy handing me some fish. So like, so the first take, like this drone comes like sweeping by us to get this panorama shot, and the guy's handing me the fish, and he's like, like you know, <laughs> freaking out on this drone. And I'm like going, dude, you can't freak out on the drone. Like just, just play it yeah, cool. Just play it cool. It's not going to hurt you. But talk about playing it cool. Uh, rumor has it, this is according to your IMDb page, that you took Tom Hanks's wife to your senior prom, is that true? Hollywood High School, and yeah, that's true. Rita Wilson, she was in 10th grade and I was a senior. And uh, and yeah, yeah, here we go, yeah, it was classic. Do you ever rag Tom about that, like, you know? I took yeah, no, the funny story <laughs> was, um, was, was, yeah, Rita and I were, were super friends, and then, you know, I didn't go into acting right away. I didn't yeah. start acting until like 10 or 12 years later. And then, uh, and I hadn't really been in touch with her, but I obviously had been following her and knew that she married Tom. Yeah. And then one day I was, I was doing a sitcom with Jennifer Aniston, actually, um, again on the Sony lot. And I was walking to work, and then I see Tom Hanks. He was just finishing Joe versus the Volcano, and he was walking towards me. And I'm like, okay, there's Tom. I wonder if I should say anything. And then he goes, he goes, my wife. <laughs> He's oh, like, we go, he goes, you're, you're that guy that's on the TV all the time oh, doing those wow. commercials. So Rita obviously was like, there's David, there's David. So he was actually a little, you know, Stop. paranoid that yeah. like, you know, Rita's like, there's David, there's David. And then just quickly, finally, we're going to close off the interview, okay. unfortunately. You are here, obviously, you're giving acting classes. Where can people get in touch with you too? We have a Facebook page, Hollywood Acting Masterclass. And I teach you what to do and how to do it to work in TV and film. It's only an eight Saturday course. Okay. But I can work, that can turn you into a working professional. Absolutely, I can teach you how to be a, a professional actor. Hollywood acting masterclass. masterclass. Yeah, Check yeah. it out on yeah. Facebook. Facebook. Yeah. And hopefully that'll help you to reach for the stars that you've been wanting to touch <laughs> for so long. Thank you very, very much to Mr. David Moran for joining us this morning. Thank but you, Kat. Here's what else you can expect on your Feel Good Breakfast show.